Hi, this is my camera. I want to show you what it can do. <laughs> Welcome back to Tech Baby's Crib. Today we're going to be showing you this Kitty Zoom camera by VTech. And uh, we're really excited to show you what this looks like, what it does, why we love it, and just a few other notes. So firstly, it's like a classic digital camera body, obviously designed for kids, very durable, lots of rubbery, um, protective stuff. On the back, you got a screen so that you can see should we turn it on? Mm -hmm. Just push the on button. This is the button to press. Okay, so we're gonna turn it on. So you see there's a nice little screen there. You can see the pictures that you're taking. Um, there are also these, so you can look through more like a classic camera, one on each side. Um, there is a home button so that you can get to the home screen. There's a little joystick that allows you to move around, an okay button, a delete, and a power button. Then on the front of the camera, we have the lens. So interest. this is probably one of the things that's most interesting to me. You have a four times digital zoom, which is cool, but it is a very small lens. Part of me just thinks, why couldn't they have made this a little bit bigger and maybe made the sensor a little bit bigger to get higher quality pictures. Really, it's the one thing um, on the camera that I thought could have been I'm different, sorry, but you, you get that trade off of, um, you know, Having a smaller having a smaller lens, it makes it more affordable, and you might not need it for the quality of pictures that are going to satisfy this audience. Okay, um, here's here's where the actual zoom is. So these are the zoom buttons, and the other thing to show you the one more thing, two more things. Small. There are two battery um, two. slots on the sides, so it takes AA batteries, two on one side, two on the other. So four AA batteries. That's an interesting choice also because it means. You know, you can use those batteries and not um, rely on needing to recharge. You can bring extra batteries with you, but it also means you, you got to have batteries and you can't recharge it. The final thing is on the bottom, there's a USB and um, a micro SD card slot. So you can actually greatly expand the storage and we'll show that maybe in another video. But essentially you can connect it to your computer with the USB or uh, store everything on a micro SD that you then put to your computer so you can these pictures can go to your computer really quickly of course the that's the the, the hey, you picture just button picture. so i could just oh, delete it, I to delete it, I i'm gonna push that button to get, though again now it's ready so i'm gonna take a picture <laughs> oops it was totally blocked okay i'm deleting that yeah, i'm see. deleting them okay I'm but first before we delete them let's just show you quickly other than taking pictures, what this camera can do is it's got, um, so the camera, it's got a video camera, it's got the picture viewer, so these are all the pictures, and we could delete a picture just like this, using the joystick, beauty, and you can scroll through the other pictures, okay, let's go home, it's got the pictures, it's got some games, which is a whole separate thing, you're going to show us that in a sec. And then it's got creative tools. So those are um, tools that allow you to, to, to take take funny photos or edit a photo. And you can add stickers or boards to it and just have some fun. Right. Now. Or um, take a panoramic picture and um, create animations also. So you can combine photos together and videos and create like a oh. little bit of a, a little bit of a, an, an animation. <laughs> And you would also do voice recording. The reason we love this camera so much is because it's actually just a great package. Like it's fun to hold, it's fun to use. You get pictures, you can use those pictures. Can it's I not see? too connected. And the ability to have these games, which we'll show you in a second, um, really, you know, it adds a layer, it adds an element to it that um, turns it into something much more than a camera. Of course, there are various settings like controlling the volume, the, gonna be the screen well. brightness, we can make it brighter how much memory you have, the resolution. I would recommend high resolution, which is not really that high anyway. And um, other parental controls. So that's an overview of the camera. That's why we love it. It's also got this great uh, carrying thing. That you can also twirl. A loop. And we're gonna show you some games.
this game, this game, this game, or this game. I think I'm gonna do this you game. You choose which one do you love this the most. One. Controls the volume from here. Okay. I know what to do already, okay? To wobble. Aww. I lost. Try again. No, let's see a different game. Oh. Mm -hmm. That's two controller buttons that I need to use. So you're just basically sorting. Yeah. And I also have to make sure I get sorting it. Sorting waste time. and recycling. That's what I have to make sure that. I get it in time. Oh, so it's got some little little games, you know, maybe good for the younger kids. Um, not super in, super engaging or challenging oh, yeah. for the older kids, but uh, great little extra feature for sure. I love the camera. Do you like the camera? Yeah. I do. Thanks for joining us in Tech Baby's Crib and Tech It Easy.